Hi, and welcome to Lay Seat's instructional video for our new braided slip-on bar wrap. This video shows the installation of the drop lever set. If you purchase the full wrap or the half wrap set, the installation will be much shorter, but follow along anyway. Before you begin, remember you'll need a razor blade or a sharp knife, electric tape, masking tape, and some kind of wet, slow drying glue. I use leather cement, however, wood glue or some other alternative would be suitable. To start, mark the top and bottom edges of your brake levers. After you tape your cables, tape the end to the bars to keep the end of the cable from sliding into the braiding. Slide the top portion of your braided grips up to the level where the, your levers will sit and just over the end of your cable housing. Now you can begin to paint on your glue. Paint it on pretty liberally because if you don't paint enough your grip may become loose and slide around. Now that you've applied enough glue over the entire area your grip will sit, you can begin to slide your grip up over the top bend. It's okay if you scrunch the, gri the grip up so it bulges out wider. This will help you get it around the bend. The only concern is making sure the end pieces stay closed and tight together, otherwise it will all unravel. I installed this top grip in two sets of gluing, one around the corner, and now I'm going to apply the glue towards the middle. Now if you make the same mistake I'm about to, don't fear. Just grab some masking tape, smooth out the ends, and just do a temporary patch with tape. Once the inside edge of your grip is placed where you need it to be, tape the inside edge with electrical tape and slick from the inside to the outside end of your bar with your hands, flattening the grip all the way as you've seen in the video. After both ends are taped, you'll have to trim the leather off your handlebars to make sure your levers fit perfectly. Make sure that your tape is tight and your glue is dried before you begin this process. When it's finished, your lever should look like this. Now it's time for the bottom section. Apply your glue and slide your grip on and slide the top edge all the way up to the base of your levers. Once you have your grips all the way to the base of your levers, wipe off any excess glue, hold fast on the top edge, and begin to pull the entire grip down towards the bottom of the bars. Once the glue has set, you can remove the masking tape and install permanent electrical tape. To finish off the inside of the levers, I've installed a couple pieces of foam rubber bar wrap and glued them to the inside. This picture shows how you install the lever cuffs from around the inside of the levers. Start your baseball stitching on the outside edges so you finish with your tails on the inside corner of your bar wrap cuffs. This will allow you to tuck the tails behind the hoods and have a clean outside surface. When you're all finished, your bar wrap should look like this. Each edge of your bar should be taped with electrical tape on the inside and covered with the cuffs. The bottom edges can be finished either by taping the bottom edges when they're flush with the bottom of the handlebar or folding them inside the handlebar and inserting a bar end. I hope this video was helpful in installing the wraps and of course I'm always available for questions on email or on my website. Thanks from Lay Seats. Bye.